conversations with God for all this pastors. Our faith is what got us through all the troubles and disasters. Indeed, we fell short, but the Lord never passed us. Our belief in God is the most important factor. It's the Velika B Project. You're now tuned in to the Velika B Project with your host, Velika B, lover of God, founder and CEO of Set Apart and Chosen. Sit back and relax and enjoy the conversation. Hey family, come on in. It's your girl Valika B. And we are here for another week of New Music Monday. I'm excited. We have some amazing guests on tonight. So do me a favor as you're coming in, share this broadcast with your friends. Hey official C J B. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold y'all listen. If y'all do not follow I am Hodo, Hodo, this is a free shout out to you. If y'all do not follow I am Hodo, he's an amazing, he's a preacher. I don't care what he said, what his title is this week. He's an amazing preacher. He speaks in the prophetic. He knows his business and he can sing on top of that. So do me a favor. If you're not following I am Hodo, make sure you follow him today. He has an amazing things that he has been working on and still he better be working on some stuff. Like, for real, for real. Uh, but make sure you follow him. Montre, what's up? I see you in the building. This is your girl, Valika B. Again, with Set Apart and Chosen, the Valika B Project, all of the above. And we are coming here with new music Monday. I'm excited um, to have today's guest, which is Canton Jones and Courtney Franklin. They have new music coming out. Come on in, uh, Montre. Oh, he's trying to bring Canton in. <laughs> Courtney is already here. I see Courtney's here. Let me bring in my nephew. Nephew, give me a shout out where you're logging in from while you while you're out here in the street. Give me a shout. What's up, man? Nephew. <laughs> you see, I want to get me some good hair today, nephew. <laughs> she got her Beyonce going on tonight. <laughs> <laughs> put a ring on it. Listen, Maybe you like Nick, thing, you put a ring on it. Nick, put a ring on it. Like, man, my, you didn't change your Beyonce. background. You got your good hair on. That was oh, took me so long, night. man. Yeah, that took me long. Like, I had to get these lights and things popping. What's up, everybody? I'm excited. Hey, hey, hey. hey. <laughs> Introduce yourself to everybody, man. Everybody, I am Montre Tisdale. If you look me up on Instagram, on Facebook, on Twitter, on Snapchat. Just everywhere you look, man, you're going to find my church Tisdale because I'm working hard, man. I'm working in these streets. You got some new things coming out? Uh, I do, yep. We're going to do a virtual to the video with my Aunt Kim Burrell, the key. Uh, we're going to do some stuff with Zicardi. We're going to do some stuff on Set Apart and Chosen. So y'all got to stay tuned, man. It's going to be bomb.com. Yep. You got to bring Kim over here one day. Thank we you. need to. We need to set that up. That's we need to set that up. Like why you bring it? Why you tomorrow. bring Auntie Kim over here? <laughs> bring Uncle Ricky. All Ricky of got them. new music out here. In these All streets. of them. <laughs> bring All them of them. On. I'm gonna need to call them tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> so bring them on. Them on like... here. Yo. Hey, family. Hey, hey, hey. I see y'all coming on in. What's up? What's up? What's up? Courtney. Yeah, but... Courtney. Courtney was in here. I did see him pop up. Courtney, are you still in here, sir? I know he's gonna kill me, man. Who is gonna kill you? Courtney. I was gonna call him. Oh God, really, Trey? I know he's Trey is a busy man, so y'all forgive him. He's gonna him. kill me. <laughs> <laughs> forgive him. He's God, a busy he man. said I'm here. Courtney said I'm here. Okay, um, Courtney. Let's see. Courtney, put in a request to join us live. I don't think I can. Let's see. I can't. What's up, Jones? Put in your Cedric Shannon Reeves. I saw Jason Claiborne in here. What's up, Jay Clay? Jason, I got to share Jason some more Jason stuff today. Yeah, Jason got some. That Jason is something, man. Jason, what I love about Jason Claiborne is Jason is always he keeps social media always popping. He is always music. popping. Every day he posts something. He does, and that's a good look. That's a real good look. Yeah, he's always working. Real good look. Cedric Shannon Reeves, what's going on? He got the big gospel fest coming up or something. I think it's in Memphis. Oh, I think I'm just going to go ahead and bring Brother Courtney in. Oh, Pastor, he's a pastor. Come on. Put some respect on his name. Put some respect on his name. I'm so, I'm so ashamed, brother. I'm so sorry. 
I'm putting you on the sick and shut in list at my church. <laughs> Brother, I'm sorry, man. Like, that, uh, you know, you know, my church, at least you get a fruit basket or you might get a $25 check. This, <laughs> at least a card. We a new okay. church. Okay, my bad. <laughs> Dog man, I see Stan Jones is on. I gotta celebrate him, man. What Stan Stan Jones, that's my dog. He big time. He famous. He's okay. very famous. He's famous. Hold on for a second. I need to grab my thing. Courtney, what's up, bro? You got it, man. How you feeling? I'm doing good. I know we ain't got you that long because you busy. You doing tapings and you got. I church am. and I'm you a hit maker you seen with james and everybody just sharing talk about your music so i know you ain't got that long with us tonight i know you famous like that i'm sorry and don't kill me no, 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 <laughs> yeah just call me tomorrow it's fine I, uh, he's so shady, <laughs> he's so shady. <laughs> you know what who um, Courtney, <laughs> I, I had to compare people but you know who you sound like your voice sound like um Pastor E. Dewey. He's not a little bit like E. Dewey, too. So Me? That's a, yeah, uh -huh. you do. Oh, okay. All right. yes, well, he's the man. He's the boss man. Listen. He is. <laughs> wow. He is. Everybody, this amazing man. Uh oh, somebody said Uncle C. That must be your niece. Oh, Pastor that's Alisa. Courtney, yeah. Courtney, hey, baby Courtney girl. Is in the house. <laughs> Pastor Courtney Franklin's in the house. How you feel, man? I feel great. How do y'all feel? We feel, feel good, good, man. But I've been seeing good. you showing out with this makeover and this new, you know, with these <laughs> carnal clothes on. We got to get your get your hands up. We got to get you free. <laughs> she need deliverance. It's all I got all over him somewhere. Steve, baby, she need deliverance. <laughs> hey, Courtney, even Uncle John was like, "Wait a minute, nephew, I got to tell Valika something." Like, she well, I saw the pictures. I was like, "Hold up." <laughs> Woman of the spread her wings in twenty two. He started drinking Dasani and not Azorka no more. So. I'm trying to make I'm trying to make money, y'all. Not not that kind of I'm, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> Woo. Never mind. My bad. Okay. Careful. Brother, I know we ain't got you that long because you gotta go. But I want you to start off by telling us how you got your start in gospel music. Got my start in gospel music. I grew up in the hood, Memphis, Tennessee, proud of it. And I did not know that there was a neighborhood choir because music was not an indigenous part of our community. Wow. And so when I oh, got wow. to be a senior in high school, some of my friends who didn't live in my community invited me to choir rehearsal. They was like, you can sing. You need to come to our choir rehearsal. So I went to the choir rehearsal and the choir rehearsal was next door to my apartments. Wow. <laughs> and lo and behold, it was Kevin Davidson and the Voices. So oh, wow. I joined wow. the Voices of Bing Hampton at 16 years old recorded my first song with Lisa Page Brooks at, at 17, entitled, I Believe, on That's the Language it. of the Millennium album, Kevin Davidson. And then from there, I went on to sing background for Ted and Sherry for a few years and uh, some spot dates with Smokey Norfolk. And then for the past six years, I've been a member of James Fortune and Fire. So that's my gospel music rundown. Wow. Wow. And what's the last song you recorded on James record that you just demolished? So James let me sing a piece of It'll Work Out. It'll all work out. But it's actually Keith Wonderboy Johnson recorded on his record. And then we oh, wow. did our live video at uh, Pastor Mike's church. Shout out to Pastor Mike. And he let me tag it. So I did that. And then me and Cardi did a piece of uh, I Need Your Glory and yeah. I believe together. Yeah. It was good. I love James. He's a great guy. Wow. That is yeah, crazy. Is. He really is. Like, yeah. shout out to James Fortune. Man. He got hits, too. Don't sleep on him. He, he does. does. He does. <laughs> that he part. Does. He's famous, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Everybody in fire, y'all all just famous. No, nah, they famous. I'm going <laughs> to the service one more time. One more time. Listen, Pastor, tell us about your church, the Power Spot. You have an oh. amazing church in Memphis that everybody is ranting and raving about. I've yet to get there to visit, but everybody speaks highly of it, for real, for real. So beyond being a husband and a dad, one of my proudest accomplishments is being the pastor at the Power Spot. Awesome group of people. We started literally from nothing. No wow. denominational backing, no money, no following, nothing. God said, leave your job, start wow. a church. So I put a flyer out, and the first week, 85 people came. That's good. And, and it's just been growing ever since. The generals in our city call it one of the fastest growing churches in Memphis. I don't know about that. I'm just glad that people trust the God in me enough to show up. So I'm excited about our church. I mean, I really wow. am. 
being wow. the pastor of the power spot. That's good. And what time is service on Sundays? 11 a.m. I've never started late. So if you come into the power <laughs> spot, you need to be there at 1058. He's so Amen. shady. That's good. I've though. That's started, good. Oh, yeah. I've started with no musicians before and docked them after they've made it. Wow. You old school for real. Oh, we, everything must be done in excellence. Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> That's true. That's why I was hoping you would call me back. Praise the Lord. <laughs> That's that young. He young. And, he, he's and this young. is my big brother. I can't either argue with him. <laughs> Whatever big, he yeah, says, yeah. Look, it's right. Believe, when I called him, he was on the phone with Kim Burrell. So, of course, he could not stop <laughs> okay. talking to a peasant. Hello. <laughs> Yeah, I, oh, I would have got slapped <laughs> and everything else. No, I love her. She's she's great. I I she she's is. amazing. She's amazing. So you got an amazing single. <laughs> Send us your piece, huh? Hiya. Hiya. Send Listen, us your piece. I was I, I'm I'm so excited about Send Us Peace because number one, it's a different sound for me. Like I guess I see some of my friends, Cedric Shannon Reeves and some of the other ones on here mm -hmm. who kind of know the lane I normally sing in. But this one is different. It's funky. It's groovy. And uh, I think the message will resonate because the whole world needs peace. I saw today where uh, someone else had committed suicide in Hollywood. And of course, we know Regina right. King's son and different other ones. We, we just need peace. Yeah, we do. I mean, a lot of people are trying to monopolize off of Corona and come up with something trendy that they think people would need because of the virus. But the truth is, more than the virus is upsetting this world. Right. We need shalom. We need the peace that we can't comprehend. And right. so those are the lyrics of this song, straight out the scripture. May it guard our hearts. And I'm, I'm just excited about this. Song. I'm telling you, it's, it's probably the most excited I've been about a song. Wow. Yeah. That's it's, amazing. It's, it's a really good song. Pastor, right. tell us who actually produced the song. Oh, me. I'm the producer. So you produced it? Oh, yeah. I, 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 I have, let me see, about, I'm trying to see how many years ago now. I think it was 2001. Okay. I became very passionate about production. Wow. So I studied and worked with uh, Cedric Thompson, uh, that's Lejeune Thompson's husband, for those of y'all who don't know, mm -hmm. see, amazing. And <laughs> Dan Cleary, he produced a lot of old Hezekiah Walker records. And then a guy in Memphis named Marquis Walker, I sat up under him. And then recently, Aaron Lewis, who produces all of James stuff. So I just gleaned from them and uh, Lisa Knowles, Smith, and the Brown Singers. I did vocal production on their album that won wow. those things. Good. And then I said, you know what, let me just step out here and see if I can do it. And so the first few things that I produced were garbage, horrible, terrible, and uh, <laughs> ridiculous, food, a mess. And so I challenged myself to just get progressively better. And uh, my last single, we made it, excuse me, we made it, I produced it. And uh, and then I produced my whole record that's getting ready to, that's getting ready to come out. So I'm excited. I love producing. Wow. Love it. Wow. But you ain't produced nothing for your little brother yet. Shame well, you know, you see, I'm trying to be same on straight, you, but you are in Oklahoma, have had nine events that I haven't even been there to wave the you, offering basket. Listen, Pastor Franklin, everybody that comes on here say the same thing. Oh, everybody, I'm everybody. clear. Everybody. I mean, he must have an elitist group of gospel singers that I haven't <laughs> been a privy to. Right, he's having another event in March. I just saw the flyer, nothing. Brother, I'm calling you tomorrow. I call. I call. I call you tonight. Let me know what that time you got tonight. I call. You. Right. Right. Um, God, I don't know if it's the Holy Ghost or just the Big Brother syndrome, but okay. Let, let, okay, let me let me get you back. So I love production. As a matter of fact, be on the lookout for one of my closest friends. His name is Jamel Strong. He is. I've heard of him. A awesome writer. Uh, he has a song, "My Hands Are Lifted Up," that has gone. Mm -hmm all over everywhere yep. i am one of the producers on his album so i'm doing a co-production thing with uh ronald rawls who is phenomenal but we teamed up together to produce jamel's new album he has great songs i cannot wait for y'all to hear his stuff wow so did you actually write sing your piece you wrote it too? yes wow. i wrote send us peace and i produced it and uh 
it was funny because this time my production concept was to garner musicians from all over the country that ne don't necessarily even know each other. So I would go right. and record organ with this one, keyboard with that one, drums with that. And so when it all came together, they even they were like, oh, my God, it's great. Work with a young, amazing uh, musician in Memphis, Christian Pipkin, who helped me with the arrangement. He is phenomenal. I mean, he's phenomenal. Y'all, please be on the lookout for him. And so wow. it was fun. And Blair Monique, got a shout out, Blair. That's she my girl. My she does all of the branding for my church, all of the branding for my music. <laughs> she gets on my nerves, but she is absolutely fabulous. Nobody and, like uh, her. <laughs> Nobody. I love, I love working with her. So she's she's helping me a lot with uh, imaging and what I project. So I, 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 I'm grateful to everybody, man. Seriously. That's wow. crazy you say that. I just took my pictures and I gave them, I put them in Blair hands and say, work your magic. So she's rebranding my brand right she's, now. You in the best hands. I know. <laughs> I love Blair. I love Blair. You're yep. in the best hands. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. Everybody on here, we want you to go get it. Courtney Franklin, if you don't have this brand new single, send your piece. Send us. Send us peace. Send us peace. Yeah. And send make sure you peace. make sure you tell them that, Trey, because some people are getting old like me and if they don't type in the right <laughs> that's type in the wrong. <laughs> Send, send us, us peace. Send us yeah. peace. Send yep. us peace by Courtney Franklin. I'm telling you, you're definitely doing yourself an injustice. You gotta go get it. It's so, 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 so good. And I'm not just gassing him because he's my brother. He is one of my favorite male vocalists. For real, for real. No, no gas. I'm serious. No gas. That, right? He it. Okay. Oh, now don't even front me like that, man. You know, I always tell you that. You he do tell me that, brother. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna graciously receive that compliment. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> I'm honored to be one of your favorite. I love your CD too. I love you, your CD. Thank Look, you so much. If, if we have, if we have, if Stella Party and Children have a stellar party in July, of course, my, my nephew will be hosting with us. Yep. We would love for you to come stop. Yes. Here. I'm going to be there. To so uh, I'm thankful that my label that I have entered into a partnership with Pebble Street Records, shout out to. Bishop E. Dewey Smith and Pebble Street on me being their wow. first artist. Awesome. Uh, they are in Atlanta. So I'm definitely coming for Stellar Weekend this year. Wow. Uh, and and I'm, we're going to turn up everywhere. I, I'm going to sing. I'm going to do the showcases. I'm going to do everything. Yeah. Uh, well, you're coming to set up our chosen first. So I'm we need coming. to call Bishop to yeah, let him no, know. Oh, you but, but, <laughs> hey, 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 my trade. It's a secret talk. I, I got some talks with somebody yeah i'm gonna tell you but i didn't even tell you okay. about that. yeah yeah so i'm excited it, it's a little, I would it's a little connection to around this page right now that's all i'm gonna say and thank y'all for doing throwback thursday with me the, uh last this oh, past yeah, week yeah, 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 yeah. It, was it was fun a lot of, a lot of people hit me up about it so i appreciate that always awesome. Awesome. always again y'all go get it send us peace by courtney franklin it's available right now everywhere you download music stream music go get it it's there you need and to reach, have it. If you don't have it, me. you ain't got no peace in your life. And you need peace. Like so Glory to God. Reach out to me on social media. I'm going to respond to everybody. I don't have nothing to do. <laughs> why does it, why is he, why is he like this? <laughs> Brother, I want you to sing something for us before you get off tonight. Uh, <laughs> uh, what am I singing, Trey? I don't know. Uh, Anything. I love you, Jesus. Sing something of your single. You know, work that work it out is one of my favorite. Um uh, okay. Uh, just whatever you feel in your heart tonight, Pastor. Okay. Uh well I was singing this earlier. It's a hymn, and I just will sing a little piece of it now. All right. Great is thy faithfulness, O God, my Father. There is no shadow of turning <laughs> with thee. Thou changest not thy compassions, they fail not. As thou hast been, woo, thou forever <laughs> will be great in thy faithfulness. 
little hand has provided. Yes, sir. Great is thy faithfulness. You've been there, Lord. Great is thy faithfulness. Thank you for your grace, oh God. Great is thy faithfulness, Lord. Um, to me. <laughs> oh, that's good. I can't that's stand good. you. Uh, that's real uh, good. I that's can't real stand good. you. Thank Ladies you. Ladies and gentlemen, know. Pastor Courtney Franklin, baby, the one and only man. I'm telling you, go get his new music, his new single, uh, Give Us Peace. I'm telling you, send us peace. Jesus, I'm telling you, <laughs> he's that guy. Trey, thank, thank you. Man. I'm looking forward to hearing from you tomorrow. Valika, you know I love you. Thank y'all so much for letting me be here. I love you too. Big bro, I love you, man, for real, for real. All right, love you, boy. Talk to y'all later. Love you, dude. Thank All you, right, sir. Peace. Well, that concludes this episode of the Valika B Project with your host, Valika B. Until next time we meet, be blessed. The Valika B Project.